Hey guys, welcome back with another video on our channel Learn with Kicks. In this video, I will discuss with you another interesting scenario based question which I have collected from my friend and which was asked in the Power BI interview recently at TCS, that is Tata Consultancy Services. So, you should definitely know how to answer it correctly so that if it is asked in your interview, you are able to answer it correctly. Okay. Now, let me tell you what was the scenario. Okay. And before that, if you are new to the channel, please subscribe and hit the bell icon to stay updated with all the coming videos, which will be very helpful for you. Okay. So let's see what was the scenario. As you can see on the screen, we have a card visual here and we have a slicer here. Okay. And let me also show you the data. So in the data, if you can see here, we have country caller and we have their respective sales. We have country India, US, UK, Canada and Australia and their respective sales. Just focus on this sales for India, which is 50,000. Okay. Now coming, coming back to the report view. So if you can see it here, so the ask from the interview was that suppose if user wants to see not the total sales in the card visual. Okay. Right now by default, if you will create a sales measure in sum, then you will get the total value as hundred K. Okay. If you will sum up the total sales, it will be coming up as hundred K. But what the user wants, they want to see by default, the sales should come as 50 K, which was of India. Okay. If I select India here, it, is, it will show as 50 K as you can see here. Now, if we don't have any selection in this slicer, the total sales is hundred K. Okay. But they don't want to see this. They want to see 50 K that is the sales of India only by default. Okay. And if they want to see any, uh, sales of any other country, they can filter out on, on the basis of this slicer. Okay. So I hope you understood the scenario. So how to proceed with the scenario? Okay. So for that, what we will do, we will create a measure for it and we will put that measure in this card visual. Now, what will be the measure, which DAX functions to be used there? We will discuss it now. Okay. So let me zoom in also. Okay. I hope it is visible now. So for that, what we will do, we will make use of variables here again. So variable a equal to, we will make use of selected value DAX function here. Why I will use it? You will get to know here. So I will make use of selected value here. Selected value, what it will do? It will return the value. Okay. It returns the value which we have selected first thing. And if we have selected nothing, it will return an alternate result. So we will make use of this functionality of selected value. So for the first argument, what I will provide, I will provide the country column here, right? Because we will be selecting a value from country column here. Now in the second argument, I will provide alternate uh, result as India. Why? Because we want to say, see the sales of India. Okay. Now close the bracket. After this, what I will do? I will create another variable B equal to, and now I will make use of calculate function. Okay. Calculate function. And then what I have to do? I have to sum the sales, some of the sales. So I will make use of sum. And then the total sales, what, whatever is the total sales. And then the filter will be applied on the country column. As you will see here, country equal to, equal to a that we have created variable here. Okay. Now close the bracket here for calculate. Then we will go to the next line and we will return this variable B. Okay. Now click here and let us see. Now, what is the result of this measure? Is this measure correct as per what is required? We will see now. Okay. So we don't have any error in this measure. What I will do? I will use this measure in this card visual. Okay. So see, this is what they wanted. So by default, 50,000 was the sales of India and that is what they wanted to see. Okay. Suppose if I choose Australia now, what is the result? It is 15K and should, uh, and let us see what is the exact sales of Australia in the data view tab. It is 15 K only. Okay. So they can do the sales. So they can see the sales on the basis of their selection here, as we have seen for Australia. But if we have not selected anything, it will show it as 50 K, which is the default and which will be the sales of India. Okay. Uh, okay. So I hope uh, you are clear with the explanation and this is what I wanted to share with you all. So please like it and share it with all your friends and colleagues, whoever are in need of this. Okay, so stay tuned for the upcoming videos. Thank you.